What's up guys, welcome back to another video, and another video inside of the Empire SMP. Whoa, everything's taking so long to load. Um, yeah, as you can tell, over there at, I guess we're calling it a bakery, slash, um, food restaurant store. Um, yeah, that's finished over there, so we will go look at that in a second. But, you may be able to tell that some things have changed over here, since the last time. So first off, we've got the enchantment table. Um, we also got the bring stand. I'm not sure if you guys saw that. Um, we also have some stuff over here. And we also have the XP farm over here, which is basically the XP farm. It's a kelp farm. So you smelt kelp down and you get easy, quick XP. But I have been working on this for a long time, probably a couple days. And I've gotten a couple books, so we are able to enchant stuff. And also, you may be able to tell by my hot bar, we got some diamonds. Not only did we get a little bit of diamonds, yeah, we went crazy mining. Um, so we got a stack and 33 diamonds, which is crazy. And I was thinking about maybe going and delivering some stuff to some people after that, but also we got a bunch of coal, which is amazing. Another thing after this that we did, we came over here and I was gonna get some rooted dirt, but before that, we got a horse because I actually traded with Alex. He was on the server earlier and I traded with him to get a saddle. I gave him like, I think three diamonds or something like that. He gave me a saddle and I was able to get a really good horse with the diamond armor I got the first episode. And then over here, I did a lot. And then over here, we have, I don't know what this is going to be con considered or called, but all the animals are here. There's a random llama. Hello, sir. Would you like to be my pet llama? No? Okay. Yeah, this is my area where I have my nether portal, and I decided to make it look like kind of what the lush caves are going to look like, but I kind of gave it my own spice, I guess, because, you know, it, it I mean, it just, it looks, it looks pretty cool. And then the village over there. And what I want to do on this side is make a huge waterfall and then have a river going all the way down here. Because my lands are going to be pretty big because I am planning on making a mega. My base will be mega, but my house won't. So my house will be a castle on top of this mountain. So it'll be pretty big. But all of this plains biome going all the way around will be my base. So it's going to be pretty big, so we're going to be having to work on that very, very soon. But let's go to sleep first. So, I'm going to have a lot of stuff to do, but first, I had an idea when I was getting a bunch of books. I could start another business. I could do a library business. I think that would be pretty cool. So, we are going to possibly be working on that today, but first, um, let me go show you our bakery slash restaurant, and I have come up with a name, I think. All right, everyone, welcome to Num Num's Bakery. <laughs> That's the best name I could come up with. But yeah, the inside looks great. I was able to finish off of all the wool. I put one of these flowered azaleas. Here's everything we sell if you want to pause and look at that. Um, out here, we have a really cool outdoor area with an amazing fireplace. Then if you come out this door, it leads to our farm. Which I have still not completed. I still will have to put wheat and carrots and everything just going along here. But I have not gotten to that yet. This right here leads to behind... What would this be called? The counter? Yeah, it leads behind the counter. And then you may be asking yourself, or you may not be. I don't care. <laughs> but you may be asking yourself, but Ace, you're a restaurant without a place to cook. Where is your kitchen? Well, that is... I'm about to answer that for you. My kitchen is right here. Yes, it may not look like much, but it is a nice little shed. We have all the food you could ever want. And then up here, we have four furnaces. So, um, yeah, this is Num Num's Bakery. And this is literally the first building in my mega base type thing. Anyways, guys, we're not going to be working on the mega base right yet, but... You know, the horse doesn't have a name yet. Y'all comment down below some good names for the horse. But I did see that llama over there, and I kind of want 
that llama in our, I guess, what are we going to call that? Our mystical, magical cave. I don't know. I don't know what we're going to call it. But I kind of want to keep that llama just because that was kind of cool. How we have this, should his name be mystical or mystic or magic? What should his name be? I don't know. But let's put him in a boat so that way he doesn't despawn. Yeah, you guys tell me another name for this llama too. We may, um, I don't, I don't know why he didn't have like a little wandering trader with him. Interesting. Today, I wanted to maybe build the library. Just get some things done because I wanted to do so much like making our diamond armor. But I wanted to do it with you guys. So let's go ahead and I guess we'll make our diamond armor. We actually don't need that much diamonds to actually make diamond armor so there we go we are now have ourselves a full set of diamond armor oh look at us Woo oh we look awesome as i said at in the first episode i believe is i want to make a medieval style base and the best way to do that is to just build randomly but i think the actual best way to do that is to make your road first and then do everything else around it so i'm gonna start laying out some wool where i want my road to go and then we may build the library and i do not have a design so this could end up being really bad Alright guys, so we are now basically done with the main road. Now, this is just the beginning of the road, so there will still be other roads, like, going off on the sides and stuff. Just, um, but we're gonna do that in a different color just for my own help, just so I know where I can put in houses and stuff like that. But yeah, this main road really is just to help me kind of get an idea of where I'm going to be building the road and where I can build my first main area. So, I either wanted to build my starter house or my library today. And what I was thinking is since I kind of already have built a shop, maybe I could just go ahead and, you know, make the starter house. But at the same time... I'm kind of like, well, I kind of want my starter house to look good because it's going to be, you know, a decent size. So, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm kind of stuck on the edge. There is, I think we're going to name it Majestic. There's, ma or, I don't know, there's Majestic, Magic, Majestic, yeah. Yeah, Majestic over there. Um, yeah, so, I, I don't know what I'm going to do. I want, I know for sure I'm going to build a bunch of fake trees around the place. Just to make it look a lot better. There's so many things I want to do. But we will not be able to do yet. Really most of the stuff we can't do until we're done fighting the Ender Dragon anyways. Like this won't be done for like a long time. Alright guys so I think I'm actually going to build the library. Because I feel like that would be a bigger building and more of a central building. And so I kind of want to go ahead and get started on that. Just so I know how I can lay out my road a little bit. Right, guys, so as you may be able to tell, I have done just a little bit more to the library since you last saw. So I finished all the pillars. I did more pillars go to and cross. And I did the wool. 
Um, I did some oak up there, but I stripped it. And then I put in some pillars down here, like, as if it's the thing holding it up. But I have realized one thing. This is going to take a ton of materials. So, I will not be able to finish today. And it's going to be too long of a time lapse to finish it in um, an episode. So, I'm going to finish it during a stream. So, if you guys want me to finish this library, I will be streaming on my Twitch. It's a sharp YT1. Um, so, yeah, make sure to go check that out. The um, me finish this library. But, yeah, um, oh, my crazy scaffolding. Which, I mean, I could technically make some real scaffolding. I may do that in the next one. But, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends and family so you can be greater than the haters. And I'll see all of you guys in the next one. Peace, say squad.